Good evening and welcome to Seven Days to Die. I'm Old Dead Man, your host. I recorded uh, these videos earlier today. I'm putting them out of order and just kind of bringing them out of the uh, for a future series called the. Uh, that's where I play uh, Stone Age equipment. Basically, there's some a few exceptions, but uh, this is for a future series. It was, but these two were particularly fun and interesting, so I thought I'd toss them in. Problem is the audio on both of on both of them didn't capture quite right. So I'm going to make commentary as the uh, videos go and uh, pick up from there. Starting off, uh, this is a quest where I'm supposed to clear out a city hall. And, well, not actually cleared out. I just need to find the supplies. And some of the audio kind of got cut off when I was speaking. So let's go ahead and pick it up and see what we see here. Evening and welcome to Seven Days to Die. I'm old Dan. I'm on my Stone Age run still, and I have got a department slash city hall to clean. Just started it, but managed to forget to start the recording right before it. It's also Horde Night, so I got to do this one as fast as possible so I can get back to base. <clears throat> it was a little bit, uh, you saw here that. You know, basically cutting off the front and end of my audio. I believe I've got that resolved, but let's get... I'm let's still get collecting out. a whole bunch of these, uh... Well, not so much the box, but, uh... Polymers here to make that true strike bow I'm working on. Interpretation. I'm still working on the true strike bow. It possible for me to actually be able to take on the top end monsters. I do have a video that I'll tack on to the end of me taking on a, an Alpha Vulture, I think it's called, uh, with my delightful wooden... You'll find that uh, at the end. Ah! Okay, that was not nice. Sounds like we've got some outside uh, critters. Okay, I'm going to have to just retrieve the supplies and get out of here. I was cutting it pretty fine. I had dinner going on, uh, coming pretty quick. But more than anything else, I was cutting it fine enough that uh, uh, against Horde Knight over here. I did not want to be in the middle of looting a building while when Horde Knight hit again. Perfect group to have something to show up in. Ah, uh, hello. How I missed her the first time and hit that fence is beyond me. It was that, uh, doesn't seem right. I'm a pretty big target myself. I think that if I manage to uh, swing a hammer in that space, I don't have to clear this time, so I'm not going to stop and spend time dealing with that guy. This on the second floor. Oh. Sounds like I've already alerted the world. It's kind of weird to do post commentary on my own reactions. Uh, I was hearing all the things going on up there, and it was really making me worried I was going to get. Sounds like there might be a wandering horde outside too. Man, look. Clank, clank and bang and everything. Yeah. Have a bit of a sporting time getting out of here. Stop there. Oh, yeah, don't puke on me. There were several points where I ended up getting pretty wo overwhelmed. I were out with just a bow. Ah! Oh, look at him run! 
That was not what I was expecting. Weapons bag. Ah, the satchel. At this point, I've been playing enough of the uh, uh, the um, Stone Age equipment here that I was getting pretty good at knowing at uh, knowing when I was going to get my butt kicked and pulling out. Problem was that uh, oh man, I've got way more stuff than I need. That, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. Although. Problem is, I was getting overconfident, so I started running in where I shouldn't have been. Ah, another cop. I hear him. I hear him. Oh, there he is. Ah, yuck. I went through a lot more med kits uh, today than I normally would have. So, clearly I need to pay attention. Needs repairs. Dang, damn it, wrong time. Thankfully, it's just a rock. Down you go. And good. Ah, missed. Where am I hitting this poor cop? I don't think that's his belly. Oh, my. They got him. Let's get medical. Fast, 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 fast. Ooh, that was bad. Definitely not feeling particularly healthy at the moment. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'll get all fancy on me. I can get all fancy with no head. Okay. Hi. <laughs> oh, my heavens, you jerk. Get rid of that. Yes, the zombies do catch me by surprise. Yes, my reactions are genuine. Oh, I didn't even know there was a safe there. I'll take a second. Oh, ooh, is this a better bow? Is it a better bow? Yeah. Plus eight. I'm gonna get it anyway, obviously. Might scrap it down for parts. Rather than... Hello, oh, arrow. One of the cuts... How many... Uh, one of the custom items on this... You're gonna make it a pain for me to get back, aren't you? One of the custom items on this particular server is the True Strike Bow. And it requires a lot of bow parts and a lot of other odds and ends. And so I made that one of my goals because the True Strike Bow is represented as being a wooden bow. That would be something that could at least reasonably fall into the abstraction of a Stone Age character. Wow, where'd you come from, lady? Oh, 
I have to admit, hearing some of my own reactions, Ooh. it's actually pretty funny to me. I mean, I am such a goofball. That doesn't mean that you're going to find them funny, but the reactions... Ah! Uh, um, not what I was looking for. Kit. Ow! Back off, buddy! Back off! Back off! Oh, she mama! That is not good. He's beating the snot out of me. Oh, miss! Dad! No! Die! Oh. There's in the... This is the big loot room, but I'm already loaded up, so I'll just grab whatever I can get. More bows, more bows, more bows. Bows. No bows. Dang it. Go down. Go to that. I'll take some answer. Oh, there's a six. I'm going to take out some of those. Those, voila, okay, I've looted the place. We're up there. <laughs> Again, I do apologize for the audio cutting in and out. It was uh, not on purpose. It just was a minor adjustment in the settings. Duffel bag? Great, with some empty jars. You don't need those. One of these days, I'm going to pick up more boxes than I can that I can actually yeah, drop, drop down, down without having to go through. Possibility, but I'd probably break my leg. Right. That will help some. Right. Oh, hi! Okay, well. Ladies, up here. Oh, I got all three. All of you. Okay, got my little baby horde taken care of. Rather impressive they managed to navigate that far. I. Yeah. Oh, okay. Successful. Yeah, this is a bit of a short run through this, so uh, there's lots of secrets I'm sure I missed. But uh, never fear. I'm sure this will come up again in the future. and Maybe I'll be able to do it on a different run or even better job on this run. Thanks for joining me today, and you have a great rest of the day. Uh, I will leave that... Um, 
Dealing with that vulture. Ah! Stop pissing at me. I will leave that, uh... Still here, beating away. Nah, I'm not getting Um... But I'll leave it, uh, for... Leave that, uh, one with dealing with the alpha vulture. For you to watch it, your... Thanks for joining me. Oh, out of stamina. Rest, 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 rest. And... <laughs> this is the video with the zombie vulture. Of course, we got the regular, but you see there's a vulture alpha behind him. 2,600 hit points. Just kind of clearing the, the uh, stage here so I don't have to deal with a bunch of different zomb zombie uh, vultures at the same time. Speaking of... Bad start. And here's my first shot with a bow. That was actually the most effective shot of all the ones I did. That said, the zombie vulture was not uh, coming down to me right away, which surprised me. And yes, I totally admit this is kind of cheesy, but... But I'm going to take advantage of whatever circumstances I can to try and kill this thing without getting myself killed in the process. It is not an easy process, no matter how you slice it. And yes, my house is still noisy, just like always. The biggest problem I had was getting up onto the stairway between runs out there. And I went through a lot of med kits and things getting this done. This is the second time I've taken down a zombie uh, alpha vulture. The first time oh, I wasn't here. recording at the time. Right. This time I was recording and I wanted to make sure I kept it. It was a very long fight. You can see from the uh, column on the left over here that uh, I spent a lot of time dealing with my, my medical attention needs. I felt very betrayed by the fact that the bird suddenly flew up in the air like that. And again, I'm having trouble getting up onto that, uh, up on the uh, stairs there. One of the few times I wish they didn't have a guardrail. Here, Vulture. Ah, ow, ow. We're getting there. One med kit at a time. When he disappeared like this, I figured I was in real trouble. Then I realized he was flying around over there, and so I went for the bow. Now, this graphical glitch was pretty hilarious. 
The head was... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but it's just so funny. And that's how you take out a zombie alpha vulture with a stone sledgehammer. Thanks for joining me.